Here's Perfetto, a one-on-one. -on -one. Into the zone right wing, Perfetto, shoot, pad save. Daniel Savelli, and the puck comes to the right corner. Blades have it as the V's are on a change. Here comes Oakville, Stefan Thompson through center. Into the zone left wing, chips it ahead, too far for Russell into the right corner against the much smaller Aiden Wright. We'll have a battle in that right corner. Four players jamming away at it, and the referee blows it dead with 9.19 to go in the second period. And now Oakville trying to sustain some pressure in the Kingston zone. They haven't really had any good series of rushes yet in the second period, unlike what we saw in the first period where they took the play to Kingston. It's Oakville who's sitting back and allowing Kingston to take the play to them right now. But another chance to turn that right around here for Oakville with a face off to Wendell Dye's left. Again, they want it cleanly to Chromie right point. Spun in behind the net. Too far for Blaney, but chased down left corner by Brandon Denham. Puck comes free, though, and chipped out of the zone by Wilhelm, who skates into the Oakville end right wing. Spins away from pressure. Centers. Wilson shoots, and it's on the skate of Kennedy in behind the net. Wilson again tries to center. He can't. Chopped at by Chromie at the left corner. Puck bounces to the point. Mason keeps it in. Shot off a body. Away to the right corner. Battle for it there in the Oakville zone. As the Blades get it up to the point and now have control. And Edwards intercepting their pass at center. Sent it the other way, and Chromie got to it. Gains the zone down the middle. Chromie to the left. Circle tries to center, it's off of Edwards. And away to the right corner, Kingston zone. Battle for it there. Lysak turned it over to Ben O'Quinn of the V's. And here comes Kingston. O'Quinn, the former Sarnia Sting, to the red line. Sending it in deep and stopped behind his own net by Daniel Savelli. Pass up the left side for Denham. With 8.25 to go in the second. Two to one, Kingston is your score. Denham's long feed off the glove of McParland at center. He settles it down, chips it the other way into the Oakville zone. Blades clear it very quickly, but a battle just in front of the Kingston bench as the puck comes back into the Blades zone. Oakville's back to collect it, and they'll play it out to center ice. Here's Denham, leaving it at the red line. Hickey gains his own left wing, centering all alone. Lysak shot off the crossbar! Oh, Oakville was so close to tying the game right there, but Lysak rung iron. But they get another chance in the slot. Lysak shoots and a save made. Wendell by. In behind the Kingston net, jammed out by Pym as a pendulum swinging in favor of the Blades here now. Puck comes up the right wing for Kingston, kept in left point by Thompson. Swung over to the right side. Here's a shot from the top of the right circle, is deflected into the high slot where it's shot right on Wendell by. He made another save. Puck loose in the left corner, Kingston zone. Comes behind the net, McParland's got it. Lifting it very weakly, and Reve keeps it in right point. Holding on and shooting, blocked by Anthony Kaliza. And he lifted softly all the way down into the Oakville zone. It hits some snow, so there is no icing against the V's with 7.17 to go in the second period. Oakville collects in their own end. Nick Reve now for, Kay for uh, Oakville. Trying to get it out, he does. Perfetto chases it down at the blue line. Turning into his own end, Perfetto. Pass up the left wing. Nyberg had his stick lifted, but got control. Poked it out of his own end. Rinaldi was there to intercept it, though. Then it's kicked free by Perfetto. He'll carry in right wing. Perfetto takes a bump at the right side board. Shug's got it, trying to center off a stick and up over the left corner glass and out of play. Faceoff stays here with 6.50 to go in the third period. Two to one, Kingston leads the Oakville Blades. And right now, Oakville coming real close to tying this one up. And much like Kingston in the first one, they had a post. Oakville getting theirs right now with the great work by Kyle Lysa to just work to the slot area and throw one towards Wendell Vi. It rings off the crossbar and goes out to keep this game 2-1 for the Bees. Listen to that crowd as the Bees win the draw. Edwards shoots and it's blocked. Comes in behind the net. We'll have a battle for it there. Jam free by the Blades up the right wing for Rinaldi. Trying to get it out, it's off a of body, loose at center ice. Mason ahead off the stick of uh, Wilson and in deep of the Oakville zone. Savelli stops it for Corbett. He'll jam it up the left wing and there's Mark McGowan passing ahead and here's Bennett. To center ice, he'll backhand it in deep. To the right corner where Mason chases it down, turns and slaps it, not out of the zone. The bouncing puck corralled by Kennedy, can't get it out. Ryan's got it right half boards. Skates down to the right corner, centers, Rebelli shoots. Oh, what a bad save by Wendell Vi. And here comes Kingston. Wilson gains the zone down the middle to the left circle. Centers, Kennedy can't get a shot away. Then bad angle shot is steered away by Savelli in behind the net. It gets caught up in the netting with 6.05 to go in the second period. Huge pad save there for Wendell Vi. Barely got that right leg out to stop the far side chance for Oakville. Yeah, just a real good reactionary save from Wendell Vi there. He read that the one-timer was coming and you could tell he just pushed right off through the pad there and made a huge stop for Kingston because they turned it right back.